Improv Everywhere! Improv Everywhere. Welcome everybody to the 12th annual No Pants Subway Ride! I want to participate! What? Stripping on the subway. <laughs> Who wears short shorts? I think like a flash mob, but naked. I hate wearing pants. That would make me feel so uncomfortable. Even little kids are doing it. Where are their mothers? <laughs> That guy looks really confused. Depending on who it is, I wouldn't mind. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've seen this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's genius. <laughs> wow, it's so cool. It looks just like from a movie. This is good, like, like Frozen. <laughs> He's so good. I would be like, what the f is going on? <laughs> There's hundreds, hundreds of people frozen everywhere. No, they are not moving. I can't move my cot. I can't move my cot. <laughs> it's, it's like they press the play button all of a sudden. Where do people come up with ideas for stuff like this? Why would people applaud? <laughs> This one built across the countertop. There's ice and lemons everywhere now. I gotta clean it up. <laughs> Even the little girl is like, what the heck? <laughs> I'm gonna need some just like these. I need a napkin. I've got an infant in my arms. <laughs> she just hurled on my pearls. She's my darling little girl. But Les Mis, lemonade style. I'm the janitor, the working man you all ignore. Oh. Sweeping up this dirty floor. What the hell is going on here? Oh, security shut up. We need more uh -oh. napkins. He's going to be in on it too. He's going to be in on it too. I'm on it. Give me some napkins. <laughs> oh my gosh, how many people <laughs> doing this? Of where I'm at. This brings so much joy to me. There's a napkin. <laughs> oh, there we go. She got a napkin. Oh. You know, I can ruin the whole thing. At the very beginning, just like, oh, I got a napkin. This one I would applaud for. So what was happening in those videos? They're like, they're flash mobs. They're kind of like flash mobs. Pranking the public. They had a bunch of people doing the same exact thing in a public area. I believe it's called Improv Everywhere. So let's dive into each one of them. The musical one there, what was going on? They were singing about a napkin, like needing a napkin, I don't even know. Their mission was to create a musical out of nowhere and it was a musical about needing napkins. And at first everyone was like, what? Like, why is she singing right now? And the thing that I love so much about it, each time someone joins into it, it's someone that you would least expect. She gets a napkin in the end. What about the one where people were frozen? What did you think about that? That was, that was pretty crazy. Like people were like, What's going on? People were kind of freaked out. It was like Twilight Zone. I think if anything, they looked annoyed. Like, I can't get through. What is going on? It kind of reminded me of like Inception, kind of. I don't know, there's like scenes in Inception where they're, yeah, frozen. That one was my favorite one. It was genius. I'm inspired. I want to try something like that now. And finally, what was happening in the subway one? They were just taking off their pants. You know, no big deal. They took off their pants. They took off the pants. The no pants subway ride. I love it so much. That one was just plain stupid. Okay, those people were in like tiny underwear that went up their butt crack. I'm like, no, not uh, guys. What would you have done if you were on one of these subway trains and saw a bunch of people with their pants off? Uh, at first, I'd kind of be like, what? WTF? I would have left. Because they're purposely trying to get a reaction out of me, I'd just be like, I'd probably join in, to be honest with you. I'd start taking my pants off, you know? I don't want to be the odd one out. I would probably be like, hey, pantsless party? Woo, let's go! It has its positives and negatives, because you can be, like, sitting down, and some old hairy dude can sit next to you, 
or you might get really lucky and like Katie Upton is right there. So the group that does all of these, they call themselves Improv Everywhere. I've heard of that. Do you think it's okay for them to do these things and disturb the public like this? I guess on occasions when nothing goes wrong, sure. It opens your eyes to like another side of life. People get so set in their routine. I have to be at work on time, blah, blah, blah. Adding a little spice, throwing a little paprika in there. Perfect. I don't really think you can stop it. We're like you can't arrest every single person that takes part in it. Tons of people with no pants and handcuffs. That's a little, that's a little bit more disturbing. Improv everywhere is very popular. What sets them apart from other prank type videos? I think it's like these are more elaborate. It's just amazing to see so many people like coming together to just have like to do one thing. Prank videos take advantage of people and could ruin their day. Whereas improv everywhere. Typically, I mean, it would make my day. Would you be interested in joining Improv Everywhere? Maybe, but I wouldn't go out with any pants. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Yes, because because why not? Yes, are they taking applicants or something? Is that why you're asking me? Yes. I mean, they do so much random stuff. Like, how many people can say they've been on a subway with their pants off? Well, in New York, a lot, but that's not the point. And now that you've seen some of their missions, are you going to check out more of them? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll definitely keep watching them. Yes. Definitely am. Yes. It makes me want to like try new things and communicate with people and like appreciate the moment that you have now because like, you know, you're never going to get that moment ever again. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Teens React. New React videos come out every Sunday, so be sure to subscribe. Have a video you think we should watch next? We'll leave it in the comments below, silly. There are a bunch of other boxes below that you can click on, so just click on them already. Till next time. Bye, and guys, put your pants back on. What's wrong with you?